What's up folks, we are back and we're going to be jumping into a new playthrough for the channel, a game that is probably one of my favorite series, very underrated. I've been excited to be jumping into this for quite some time and that is Darksiders. So I know you've heard or have seen the recent video that was put out by THQ on presumably a new Darksiders that is going to be coming out at some point in the future. So that kind of just sparked me wanting to jump back into Darksiders. I haven't played the first one since I was in college, so it's about maybe 10 years ago, probably more than that since I last played. And I love these games. I've only been the first two, so what I'm gonna do is play through the first two again and then jump into the third one eventually. I've never played the third one, as well as I've never played Genesis, which is, I believe, in between the third one or is after the third one i'm not sure but in any case we're going to be playing darksiders so sit back relax and enjoy since the dawn of time the armies of heaven and hell have waged an endless war drawn to the conflict was the charred council an entity bound by ancient laws to preserve order and balance it held that any great power unchecked threaten the very fabric of the universe. In time, heaven and hell came to honor the council and its laws, for none were beyond the swift and terrible justice of the council's enforcers, a fearsome brotherhood known as the Four Horsemen. Amid the turmoil, the first humans emerged. The council foretold that these weak but cunning creatures would someday be integral to the balance. Thus, a third kingdom was named, the Kingdom of Man. By order of the Council, a truce was forged between heaven and hell. The Great Pact was bound by seven seals to be broken at the appointed time, when man's kingdom stood ready for the end war, a battle that would bring balance and determine the ultimate fate of the Three Kingdoms.
Now, when I played this game and beat it originally on PS3, I beat it on normal, so this time we're going to play it on a clock you know. Of course, it's been years since I played it, so I'm going to be very rushed to, just to try to figure out the controls for this. But it's, it's already coming back to me. I to play this. Get your ass down here. This game is so much fun. I forgot to get so much damage for attack. I get take so much damage for attack when I'm in this difficulty. Oh, we can. I didn't even do that, but uh, it is what it is, buddy. That. I believe those titan looking creatures are our allies. Gotta save. Okay, he's gone. Definitely pulled him down. I don't even remember the the main story from the first one. It's been so long. I know that they called and actually you know what? I'm just gonna just as it reveals itself I'm just gonna like remember stuff. I'm not gonna say anything. Alright, this is where we go over here. Oh, you. Come here. Come here. Come here. Guy up there. He's he's out there. I always love the art style in this game too, or in the games. I know the third one changed it up a bit, I think, but in the first two, I definitely love the art style. I think what I'm thinking of in the third one, they went more, I guess, 3D. Well, obviously, they're all 3D games, but I guess the, like, maybe the exaggeration in the third one is different from the first two with the character proportions. But we'll find out eventually when we get there. Come here. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, okay. Jump on horizontal pipes and wires to grab and traverse them. Yeah, the controls are need to come back to me. Is there a chest over here or no? Just go ahead and skip y'all. Unless y'all want to come up here and die. I guess y'all do.
working. I guess that was at saying something about the dash. Is it gonna blow up? Okay, well, it's on fire, but I thought it would just blow up. Not this way. War is such a badass dude. Impossible. Abaddon. What is this? Where are my brothers? This cannot be. The final seal. My lord! How did this happen? near object okay we can use the cars as weapons <laughs> all right 
stupid shit. Was a jump at that point, okay. It's all a timing thing. Okay, that is bad. I jumped out of the way. Oh, well, okay. Got a car. Damn, I forgot to jump again. <laughs> It's pretty easy. Give me another car. were broken. I was summoned. Then where are the other horsemen? Were they not summoned as well? The seven seals are hidden, as they have been since the pack was forged eons ago. All of them intact. There was no call. You waited the Dark Ones, broke a sacred covenant that is doomed mankind, and threatened the balance. Do you deny it? When I rode, heaven and hell were already at war. Abaddon was there. He knew something. Abaddon fell, fighting off the chaos you unleashed. I fought powerless against the demons, and still you accuse me. Your defeat proves nothing. Likely the Destroyer cast you aside when he was finished with you. You have defiled the law, Horseman. You will be punished. 
I serve only the Council. Only the balance. As the horsemen always have. Send me back. I will punish the ones responsible. How? What hope do you have against the Destroyer's armies? You are powerless. Then I will fail. And the demons will have carried out your sentence. Very well. You will return to the Earth. But you will be watched. Come forth. All right. Alright, so we gotta arm ourselves, which I believe. Where am I going over there? I should go over here. Right? Or. There it goes. Good to uh, get out of here. War's legendary blade also stripped of his former strength and powers. Harnessing the power of the Chaos Eater, this attack summons a field of deadly blades around war. The souls of the dead will be your currency. Some enemies are more easily bought than killed. I just realized, I think that voice actor for that one in particular played as Dumbledore the second Dumbledore in Harry Potter in the Harry Potter movies I was like his voice sounds so familiar I, I could be wrong but it sounds like him I believe he passed away recently Council confers with demons now, does it? Since the truce was broken, some demons have fallen from the destroyer's favor. I think that's him. Volgrim is one such outcast. He has long sought an audience with us. How long have I been here? Trajectory was a little off. Mm. Not so fast, horseman. <laughs> Let's lay down a few ground rules. Until this is over, you're a dog on a leash. I say bark, you bark. And if I have to kick you, you'd better not bear your teeth. Understand? Or should I teach you to play dead? Good boy. And of course, 
that guy is obviously gonna tell Mark Hamill voice acting that one voice acting the watcher Yeah, let me now know now in the comments if about the voice actor for the other ones, it being Dumbledore. Correct me if I'm wrong. This. Here comes the welcome party. The biggest thing, one of the biggest things in this game, or in these games that I like a lot, is I know there's a block feature you can get eventually, from what I remember, but I rarely use the block feature. I just rather dodge out the way and stick it into another attack, because the block kind of slows me down, blocking in general, whereas the dodging around it feels so much fun as you like it's pretty much skate around the area as you're fighting and the more stuff we unlock it's just gets even more chaotic and fun at the same time oh i hate these guys yep because they explode Gauntlet glow, Ga War's gauntlet glows near interactive objects such as chests or doors. Press circle to activate them. Okay. Right. I don't know if we're supposed to go all the way down. No. I think we just go up. Should actually dodge to the right to avoid these guys, but they just attack straight on. Yeah. Shit, so explode. Nice. Thank you for that. That's it for the enemies in this room. Get out of here. It obviously, it's telling us to, how to drag objects. Just hold circle down, push them forward, or pull them. Excuse you. Chest down there. You don't need it. I'll gladly take it. Excuse y'all. Get out of my way. Oh, 
just skating around is just so much fun. You know, I know it's a dodge, but it looks like he's skating. <laughs> I guess he's dodging back and forth. Alright, more scrubs. This guy reminds me of y'all ever play World of Warcraft. Um, there's a raid boss. I think his name is Mactheridon. Oh, I could be saying it's wrong. But that design looks kind of like this. That boss. Oh, he moves. Okay. Let's see. Wait. When he raises his fist like that. Right at the tail end of it. He's down. Time to die. Bye bye. here? No. Going crazy. We came in here, right? Or no? We didn't. didn't hear you coming. Volgrum. The council finally took me seriously. If so, you're surely not empty-handed. Well, this shall be the briefest of introductions. Jesus, these character designs are so cool looking. There were a few young ones. Oh, spectacular. You seek the power behind the one called Destroyer. You will find the answers and the font of his power there. Oh, such haste to die. 
You aren't even a shadow of your former self. You wouldn't last a heartbeat. Besides, the way to the tower is shrouded by demon magics. Even I do not know the way. Who does? Feed my hunger. And I'll feed your curiosity. Alright. So we gotta collect 500 souls for uh, Volgrim. Which should be easy, I believe. We can obviously kill these enemies here, but I think there's chests around in the area. A demon trinket that reveals the location of all nearby chests on the map. Yeah, so there's a chest down here that we can get. I'm just gonna go keep moving. Oh, hello. Souls chest. Oh, I gotta remember to dodge right at the last moment. The one thing about dodges, they don't. You can't do it until after the, the attack that you're doing, like the swing you're doing, is complete. So the dodges interrupt your, um, your attacks, which could be a disadvantage at certain points when an enemy is like, attacking you. You can't just immediately dodge out the way so quickly, which is something I had to get used to doing again. I don't know if it's like that in the second one or in the future other titles, but at least in this one it's like that. Okay. Also let me know in the comments what is your favorite horseman out of the four from these games. I think I love war. I think I'm, I'm like Death more. I think that's the name Death. The main uh, protagonist in the second one. But that's just me. I, again, I could be getting this name wrong because I haven't played the second one in years. Was, I'll press R1 while stationary to block incoming attacks. I don't want to do that. Like I said, I don't like blocking. I'm curious to see how the other two horsemen play once I eventually play the Genesis game. Souls chest here, also some scrubs. All right, so we need less than a hundred left. There's one up here that we can get somehow. Here? No, that's not it. Actually, how do you get up there? Oh. Okay, so something that we don't have yet. Is there a chest down there? No, but there's a chest over there. Get out. 
here. What do I hear? Oh shit. See, I gotta. Oh, I dodged it. Okay, good. Chest. I think there's a chest over here. Yes, he is. Oh, there's a health chest. I think there's one down, down below. Good now. To get these things to Volgrim. We have enough souls to feed Volgrim's hunger. Now, maybe he'll feed our curiosity. have a mind of their own, but with this, you may reach an understanding. Beyond the gate, seek out Samael's prison. Once, Samael was close in power to the Dark Prince himself. Some might even say, a threat. You will find, he is no friend to the Destroyer. Seek me out when you've gathered more souls. I will make it worth your while. Find a demon Samael. Oh boy. I remember that guy. Oh wait, before I even do that, I want to go and masterfully carve horn who call awakens ancient gates. Press R2 to activate the horn when equipped. Some creatures can be knocked back by the earth crawler's deafening blast. Or right, do that, can I get any upgrade? On your journey, you may come into possession of certain items that are of particular interest to me. Artifacts of the fallen legion. If you discover any legion artifacts, bring them to me. Get an upgrade. Never mind. Okay, select the desired gear item. Map select the item to a gear slide and press the any directional button to equip the gear item in the game. Game 
wait. I can't wait to find out what's behind it. <laughs> Nice, we got a health chest. I don't know if we even need this. This looks like a library of swords. Here. Shit, it wasn't blocking the wrong enemy. Shut up. The yeah, Chaos Eater courses with energy and destructive power increases. Okay, leveled up. Oh, back up. Is there anything up here? Nope. Actually, is something over here. And okay, it's one of those things that we saw earlier. I don't know if we could get over there though. Maybe later on, I don't know. Shit. There's two swings. Face. I think we're done with that one. Scaldling, scalding gallo. It's up here. Another soul chest. There's also a chest over there. I don't think we can get to that one yet. Maybe later on. One thing I wish we could do, maybe we could do it later on in the game, is like air dash. That's insane how you can like repeatedly dash into them to knock them back. Or stun him at least. Attack. 
like summoning enemies. I'm just gonna stand around and just get chomped up. I, I... in there. Just hmm. Guess we gotta do the opposite side too then. and made you a coward. Perhaps there is a way, but you will need to get inside the Destroyer's Spire. The tower is guarded by four of his chosen. Bring me their hearts and ask me no questions. My reasons for helping you are my own. Where can I find these guardians? First, seek the Twilight Cathedral, where the Bat Queen Tiamat has gone to roost. The whole of her domain is a blistered inferno. By land, you will never reach it. Find the high ground with this. And bring me her still beating heart. I gotta admit though, as like with all character designs in this game, Samuel just looks freaking cool. No, he's a prick, but <laughs> his design is cool. All right, Shadow Flight. These natural supernatural wings enable or to temporarily glide. After a double jump, hold X to activate Shadow Flight and glide. Glide inside Shadow Currents and to soar high into the air. Here, 
activate war shadow flight and shadow current to perform a huge huge leaps like we just did now i wish see right there i wish when we were in the air like that we can just do like a dive bomb attack maybe we couldn't if we unlock it i don't know maybe it's something in the future Blow up. Okay. that to raise the sensitivity of the camera itself because it's a bit slow for me at least that's it choking grounds I remember this area when I first played. Do I have enough souls for anything? Let me see. Okay, we have almost 700. I do have something. Okay. I want to get the Demon's Edge. They want to eventually unlock the site, the harvester. Samael has eventually. Uh, excuse you. Come here. That was that. That. Combo right there was like one of the staples I've always done. Like you bring with air, then bring down. I think over time it gets more ridiculous as I level up that uh, ability or attack. I mean. It's like two different ways of doing it. You can either just pop them up and then you can just fully slice down. But either way, you just do some good damage to him. Hello. Come here. Alright, so we have to go over here. I do need some help though, but it's all good. There's a chest over there.
But a powerful curse holds me now. I cannot help you. Any curse can be broken. Yes, perhaps. These servants of the Destroyer walk unseen within the realm of shadow. By their blood we are bound. By their blood shall we be free. I can no longer move within the Shadow Realm. Much of my power has left me. You need not enter it. I will grant you the power to see into the accursed realm for a time. But to what end? What hope have we now against the Destroyer's foul sorcery? Hope will not bring you freedom. Yes. Oh, Find cool. where these shadow workers hide and kill them all. They can't be that hard to find. So we gotta kill some shadow workers. Oh, we gotta jump into the portals. Yeah, I remember. Okay. Alright, so we have a challenge, I, I think. Yeah, there it is. Beat five enemies using aerial combos and the time limit. Bonus souls will be rewarded for any time left on the clock. Okay. Get up. Surely this is no challenge for the likes of you. What? There we go. I'm like, oh, well, I screwed that up. Oh, I'm hitting up with the air. Okay, there's one. Excuse you. I'm going out. Jeez. Sir, you just back away from me. Two for one, thank you. So we got some health back, which is great, and they definitely needed that. So we got three more left. What's this? Beat 40 enemies within a time limit. Bonus souls will be rewarded for any time left in the pot. This should be easy. This should be easy. That's 
that lariat into an upper, to an aerial is so sick. I just gotta remember how to do it on a whim. Like, I could do this, obviously, but this is a cookie cutter launcher. But there's one. No, that's not how you do it. Oh, shit. Where you come from? What's the challenge? Deal with 50 enemies before war is affected and health depletes. Bonus souls will be rewarded for any remaining health. Okay, this should be fun. Chest over there is two, three chests. Okay. Actually, no, I have, I have another help. Okay, maybe not now. See the guy. Yeah, damn it. He's down. Yeah. 
Bella next. did it. Can I open this? Let's get out of here. One more to go. this challenge smaller or weaker enemies can be killed instantly at any time larger creatures must be stunned before they are slain use circle to instantly kill a small or stunned creature kill any enemies using only wars instant kill attacks within the time limit bonus souls awarded for time limit that should be easy Yeah. Got almost 1600 souls, which is great. Might get that sight. Oh, shit. I'm supposed to like kill with them. Big guy here? No. You. You. I've never seen them crawl like that on the ground.
Not good. Alright. Not an easy challenge. Counter wars reflect the business except in awoken, allowing him to counterattack physical and projectile threats. Press R1 just for the moment of impact. I think I used a lot of countering my first run with this, so I gotta remember how to do it. I gotta be used to doing it again. Go upgrade some stuff first. Real quick. Weapon master. Please take your time. Who's the damage inflicted by weapons? Attack. Let's get that, of course. And then. Man, I want to get the scythe. I'm actually really close to getting it, though. So, you know what? I want to kill some stuff real quick to get it. This enhancement increases war's damage with environmental weapon attacks. Hmm. It just upgraded. I thought I'd climb up that. Oh. Hold on. What is down here? What the hell is that? Oh, this just souls, which is great because we need more souls to get that sight. Oh, that's how to get back up top. Okay. I think now, excuse, excuse you. Now I have enough souls, so let me go get that sight real quick. Other chest, okay. This is for rage. Oh no, wrath shard. Okay, collect four shards to create a wrath core that increases wrath maximum. Wrath. Our maximum wrath. Okay, I think I read that wrong. I can't climb up there yet because I think I need an item. But I'm glad we got that. Alright, let's get that scythe. Oh, the Vulcan 
Mom's got something new for you. Sight's massive curved blade performs large sweeping attacks that devastate multiple enemies. Um. It's already equipped, but I just wonder if we can also add that as yes, we can the enhancement to it. Okay, so this will help with the environmental attacks. Get going. your help. See him some more bats down there. Probably gonna follow me, which is fine. Don't necessarily have to kill them, but they do give me health when I kill them. Oh, I can do that, but that one's giving me health. Right. big guy. So doing that Larry, you just gotta What am I doing that? Am I double tapping the main attack button? Oh it's one attack then attack one and then you pop up. Maybe that's how you do it. No, that's not it. Maybe it's one attack then directional. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Dead. 
only have 300 souls right now, but hoping to get another upgrade. Somehow. I don't know if anything costs 300 souls, but I don't see anything down here that we can get. Oh. That, though. Love to see it. Alright, these ancient insignias were given to the legions of hells as trophies for the carnage of the end of days. Turn it to Volgram, he'll reward you. Nice. Which is great. The swim? Hold on. I forgot we could swim in this game. Let's help. Lifestone shard. Collect four shards to create a lifestone that increases wars and maximum health. Okay, good. Okay, so I think he came from down over there. He's over here. Extra 500. Could buy a Wrath Core? Huh. Okay. Nice. I could do that in the air. I kind of want that. It's 400, so if I do 400 plus. Maybe this one or the harpoon tackle. Mm -hmm. See anything you like? I'll do that. So it's R directional plus R1 square. And then I'll do this. Shit. Yes, I like that a lot. Then you can just pop up, and then slam down. You can actually just pop up and slam down. That's really cool. Or you can like pop, boom, boom, boom. Wait, I wonder if you can. Let's try something. Oh, that's sick. Okay. So there's two two attacks. I'm like kind of laughing right now. <laughs> One, two. Okay, I'll figure it out once I get enemy. You could attack twice. You could attack twice. Pop them up. One, two. One, two, three. And then slam down. That's pretty sick. I like that a lot. That's going to be a combo that I'm going to constantly be doing. My only issue with it potentially is being vulnerable while you're up in the air like that. Especially when you're dealing with like big enemies. Which is why I wish... And maybe, again, it could be in this game at a later time you'll get it. Like an aerial dash. 
There's a health thing over there. We don't need it unless there's an artifact over here. No, it's not. Okay, good. I like funny y'all. Oh my god. Hello to you too. Oh. Alright, so I guess we have to wait till he gets over here. Does two attacks. Does a slam down too. You're dead now, sucker. Just uppercut him. Is this apocalypse difficulty? <laughs> I mean, I definitely feel every time I get hit. Makes a large chunk of health. Oh, what is that up there? I need to get up there. Maybe I can't get up there from here. Let's try one more time. Or maybe I jump up from over there to get up there. Let me try that. I, it might not work, but. Work. Okay. The stairs over there, so I'll probably eventually get up there once I find the key. This is probably the key. Yeah, there it is. Where is the door? Oh, upstairs. Let's try to get that.
It's there, beneath the stench of this place. You can sense it, ancient. From neither the White City nor the Black Depths, something lost between. We won't be able to get it. Oh, shit. Okay, press R2 to shoot. Press and hold R2 to tag enemies for homing shots. Hopefully we'll come back here. I'm not sure if we... Maybe we can. Guy has a gun. Yep, he has a big gun. Shit. Just in the thick of time. Took too long. Charging. Let's just shoot him. How am I hold, constantly holding charge? I mean, it's more convenient just to do that way, but. Can I just leave? Guess so. Have shields, I think. Say, could I shoot a guardian? I don't even know if it's called a guardian, it might be a titan. Dead. 
Oracle go and attack straight on to them and they've been dying at first hit. Hoping we're almost out of this area of shooting these guys. Any more? Yes. Done with that. I think that's Tiamat right there. Tiamat. Yes. How many souls do we have? Oh, we got 1700. Okay, that's a good amount just for some more upgrades. Come here. Come here. It's not over here, but that's oh, a chest. Is Volgrim over here? So, probably the entrance. Oh, there he is, okay. Yes. Okay, so... I can get... Demon's Edge. What's the Harvester? That's legendary sight, devastating multiple enemies with large sweeping attacks. The harvester also reaps more of souls from fallen enemies. That's 5,000 souls, but something to keep in mind next time. I. What's the flip saw? Flip saw is. That's the one I want. Okay. I'll get that. And then I'll get something. Meteor strike. This is what I wanted. Okay. Drive too hard a bargain, friend. Okay. 
Okay, so L Razor. So many combos you can do with this. Glad we could dash. Probably not gonna ever use that. Could upgrade our sword up a cut though. But I'll get this. Yes. That's what I want. That's great. Okay. Now it's only like dashing forward, which is fine. There's no like can't choose. Well, you can kind of. But it's not really a uh, it, it works. At least for now, we'll obviously be testing it out in the future. So a labyrinth crystal blade identical to the mounted on the those mounted on the statue. So this one has it. Assuming you put it on this one. So glad I got the air dash. So we can't do anything, I don't think, with that statue piece yet. So the only places to go would be one of the doors. Be this door over here. But I missed that. That. So let me try something real quick. Not that one. And then you can like. Oh my god, that's so sick. But the thing with that is it pushes them away, which is fine. Unless you're like. There's a bunch of enemies around you, which will still work. I love the... I was saying, I love the uh, amount of variety of attacks you can do in this game. Like, the scythe is just, for me, feels like an extender for combos, which is great. Throw the sticky bomb onto objects and enemies for that need strike it for an instant explosion.
So we obviously gotta push this back down there. Chest up here. Can't do anything in that yet. Excuse you. Scrubs here. How do you do the? I did not mean to use that. Gotta look at the. Uh... There's a move I want to do down in my. Harpoon tackle. That's what I wanted to do. So it's. Uh, so you gotta do it at the same time. Okay, that's. I think I've been doing that, or a variation of it. I guess. <laughs> Pushes them more off. It's funny. the key right yet yeah, is let's go back to that place where the key was where that door that's locked Actually, I'm going to check move list real quick on the vertical site attack. L razor, okay, so L. It's not it. Hold on. Oh, it's down. Okay. And you like pop them up and then throw that at them and then jump up. There's so many, many different combos you could do. You try it. Oh, that's not it. Oh, I don't. I pop up with them, which is. Oh no, come on. No. Oh, maybe you don't hold it. Let me try it. Let me do an enemy around. I get on my nerves. Okay. Yes. 
Okay, that's really cool. So then, after you do that, then you can jump up and then do some more combos. Learning as we go. Jesus. It's like, what did we get in here? Just had a brain fart. Okay, we got the sword, which you can go back to the one of the previous rooms and put it in the statue. Oh, something is over here. Not this one. That. Nope. That one over here. with that. He's still fighting. Okay, so... Ooh. Okay. I'm sure there's enemies in here. That. Um, of course. Actually. Let's take care of the big guy first. All done. What? Okay. I don't think I have any. I don't think I have any help. Could just wait. I didn't do damage to him? Okay, that did. Shit. I had to hurt him. Hey, finally. Jeez. Oh my god. Alright, that should be it, right? So I could just throw it. I thought I th destroyed it before, but I guess somehow I missed. There we go. Oh, 
We don't even need this. Oh no, that's lifestone. But it does heal us. Another one over here. What the hell do we? Can I? Hmm, maybe I could dash over to it. Unless I could just do this. No, that is, okay, we got it. Hoping we should be getting closer to Tiamat soon. I reckon. Let me push this down. There's something over there too. Oh, push it over there. I wish I could just kick this. direction we want to get it to. If we could go that way, but also this way too, but there's something there. Come back to that. Hello. <laughs> I didn't know I could do that. That's funny. Okay, let's drop this. Peace. Wondering also, I want to try this. I don't think this was gonna work. No, this is not gonna work. I was trying to like get it to the door to then throw it. Maybe. Try it. I can't dash with it. No, it won't work. That's too close. I don't even think I can open the door. With it. Let me see how far I can get. I'm too scared to like keep it. No. Yeah, I won't, I won't make it. Alright, let's jump down. Oh. I think that was the same one that I pushed off. Now, by the way, I am playing. On the PS4 for the time being. I don't have my PS5 with me, but I know we can just transfer the data over to the PS5. So once I get my PS5 back, I'll probably transfer it all the data over there and just continue my playthrough there instead of the PS4. Is this? It's cow chest over there. Whoa. 
That looks sick. Okay, it's a crossblade. I finally crafted a throwing blade that can strike multiple targets. Enter aim mode by pressing R3 and then select up to five targets by holding RL2. Press R2 to throw the crossblade. I'm sure enemies will be popping out. Okay, there. They shoot fire. Nice. There's more. Got it here. Dead. Dead. What the hell? hell is that? Charge a crossbow where he's holding the R2 and he'll grind on enemies. Does that explode? It looks like it. Let's keep him back for the time being. Plus a combo with this, which is sick. Does that foul shit. Combos you can do. <laughs> the more with the more stuff we get is so fucking cool. He dead? Oh, okay. What's like? What the hell's going on? Keep an eye out for the watcher icon. What is this place? I have to admit, for a bunch of weaklings, those humans were full of surprises. Who knows what secrets they buried down here? All right. I'm just making sure that I'm not missing anything before we move on. Four. Okay. Can we just throw the boomerang onto that thing and make it explode? Okay, so that's how we lift it. Oh, not yet. Um, let me think. Probably over there. Can we get. Can we jump. Oh shit. Shit. We don't have a key yet. I don't think we do. No, we don't. How do we get up 
there. Oh, I'm so dumb. Alright, so now we should be able to do something with a switch. That opens there, okay. here oh we can like right when i was about to say it uh imbue crossblade the crossblade can absorb arcane energy from certain targets it strikes press r3 to aim and throw the blade with r2 at an energy source tagging multiple end targets will transfer energy from the source to all targets okay so we're going to transfer the fire to them make it explode sick like this is a puzzle that we have to solve now in this room great okay another room and just blow that up So, two sides, we can blow those crystals up, and this door is locked, I see some s switches over there, come on guys, leave me alone. Okay, so we have to get, presumably, over to those switches here. It's a third switch there. How do we blow up? I'm pretty sure there's more switches behind these red crystals. Which... Let's try to... What happens if I click one? Oh. Okay. So then let me jump over here. That does. Jump as a precaution. I should have jumped over to that one. still alive okay so hmm. maybe we were supposed to do this actually get over to this to move that yeah okay good we solved it all right now we get that out of the lava and we can use that to blow these things up Okay. 
that. Another switch behind there, or? What's over there? Before I even do this, I want to see if I got everything out of this room first. There is a chest over there. Where we can definitely get. Somehow, we get over there. That's I. Probably gotta. Click this again. To make this go up. Yeah. And that's how to work it. There's another switch. Oh, that brings up all of them. Okay, cool. Nice. Wait, then what's all the way at the top then? Oh, that's how you get back up there. Okay, cool. So then, just died right there. Oh. There's another sword, which we definitely need. Thank you. supposed to go over here. No, I have to go up there somehow. Oh, it's probably to get back onto the cable. That make any sense. Why would they have me go over here? Or give a pathway at least to go over there. I just go through the wall, I think I did. Oh. I didn't even see this. Oh, okay, thank you. Nice. Alright, then we pull this down. to do is get back up to this cable here to get out of here. Show. Can't reach it from here. It is fine. This is one that's already used. So I think we go over here. We've already done this. I don't know why it's taking me so long to think. Yeah, this is right. Easy. What's over here? Anything? Okay, no, that's not. Oh, 
Okay, so we gotta find three swords, basically. So we only have one so far. Two more to go. Okay, so... Chest right there. I don't think we need it right now. We haven't gone up here yet, I don't think, yeah. Oh. Another sword there is not too far away. Behind that Blowing lava. Okay, so. What's that do? Ah, okay. So we need to blow those crystals up. And there's also a thing over there which I do want. But I will get it later. Okay, that's a. Looks like a dormant version. Which we blow up with fire. Okay. And then. Okay. I think I know what to do. Probably not the cross. Yeah, I want the cross over there. Down. was interesting though and I'm gonna knock on wood the only times we've died were to like environmental moving movement or whatever just navigating the environment not through combat okay so if I throw this Inert bomb growth. To grab and throw this dormant sticky bomb on objects and enemies, use fire to detonate it. <clears throat> so ideally, can we place multiple ones or is it just one per? That blows that up. I can now move. So one up there, another level. Can I not? Oh my, oh, don't do that. All right, now we should be good. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm going to jump down here to get this thing real quick. Artifact soldier. Okay, this is what we give to Volgrim. Great, great, great. And we... I don't think I need another one. At least not oh they they're constantly rotating or is it just time based that's yeah it's rotating on a timer okay so Get that over there, but we gotta bring it over there. So I gotta wait till this switches again, which is about to do right now. 
Then we get that. But that was not what I wanted to do. I need fire. Why didn't I just... Oh, wait. I know what to do. This last is actually good if that I place it there. So I want to use that one on top to blow it as like a trail. So I was like, where's the fire? I was like, oh, well, we could use the explosion up there as fire. Alright, this should work. Like we need to do all this, but we go. there we go. All right, now another. Switch. Oh god, not these damn stupid bats. I'm gonna take one of these as well. Blow up that other one over there. And there is a fire. Sure. We got it. Yep. There we go. That is pretty cool. That's a way to block progression. Two swords down, one more to go. It's probably that door right here that's locked. It's the last one, yeah. Pressing L1, or holding L1 instead of L, pressing L2. That was it, right? Key, yeah. Alright. Great. Wrath shard, okay, we need three more of those. Ooh, 
we need? Uh, I'll take the health. I think we haven't been to that one over there behind us yet. I think? No, I think we have. Yeah, we have. Okay. Maybe the one across we haven't been to yet. Yeah, we've been there too. Where haven't we not been? In there. Oh, oh, it was behind us. Okay, there was a locked door. We got a key. Duh. Over here. Oh, I see you, enemy. I'm not going to even bother with you because you're wasting my time. I need you to move out of my way. You come up here just to fight? You do you? Just so your buddy just died. these damn bats. Hey, they're dead. Dead. I almost jumped off <laughs> and I'm luckily I'm so glad that my control didn't pick up the input okay that's that then we go open here this looks like a room we're going to fight in, most likely. Yep. Oh, fuck. The hell is that jailer? What's he doing? Oh, he's just... You know what? I should. These guys drop health or something. Oh my god. A help. There must be some way to rupture this meat bag's fleshy spot altogether. Oh, duh, stupid. Y'all to drop health, not rage. I mean, rage is great, but what am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, 
Oh, that's dope. I need to go back. There we go. Run, 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 run. Actually doing a pretty poor job killing these guys. It's not dead yet. Okay, I'm about to say I was like, well, he's not dead yet. This guy. Way back away. It's fully still red. That's why. Stupid. Fire right there. What if I actually... It's not good. Oh, level up our Chaos Eater, which is great. Not to kill you. Fire, yes. I think that could fully get up. Oh, it can. Okay. So I think there's probably the dormant ones, right? Yeah, they're back there. Which we can. So I gotta bring the fire from all the way back there. Two, three, four, five, 
Fix. Doesn't matter, I can still do it that way. There's another one back there. I did it in reverse. God damn it. Two. Which I think that we need. No, I don't feel like fighting y'all dweebs. it. Say, is there more enemies? Okay, so the switch over here will get us over to that side. Is what I imagine. Been over there. I think we've been over there, maybe? I don't think so, actually. What's this? I gotta explore. Throw it in the air, that's so sick. Okay, we definitely haven't been up there yet. I don't think. Oh, I think we have actually, because this looks familiar. I think this looks familiar.
Yes, more enemies to fight. Hello, suckers. God damn it. You sure about that? That is the last sword. We need oh fuck. Thought we were done. Or, oh fuck, there's two of them. You know what's funny? When I was finding that one by itself earlier, I was thinking, I was like, what? I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to fight two of these at the same time. What's he doing? Come here, come here. Now it's you. Circle. Thank you. All right. We're done now. Sweet. All right. Um, we head back to the main room. Place his final sword. You know, they're right. Yeah, we've been. Wait, is that the way we're supposed to go? I think so, actually. I think so. Side of this. Let me get over there. All right. 
Sweet. Now that we have the final sword about to be placed, where do we go next? Unless this is the elevator in itself. Might be. Yep. Oh man. For a second there I got extremely nervous cuz I looked at my uh my OBS and I thought I wasn't recording the PlayStation audio. <laughs> oh, like what? Oh, I've been so pissed. That has happened before in the past. Okay. I am going to need a health chest. I'm assuming as we're going out, this is where the boss battle is going to take place. Right? Maybe? I don't feel confident at all with this health where we're at right now. Hoping there's some yeah, he's over she she's over there. And I see some dormant. I guess we gotta throw it on to her. What's she doing? Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. That's on oh I see now, I see shit. She's gonna land. Okay, we gotta do that again. I'm right here, right here. Okay, I don't have enough health. Need you to stand still. You should have considered my offer. <laughs> Such a pity. Come on. Come on. Oh no. I wasn't even paying attention. I forgot she does that. Threw it all, huh? Oh, I gotta make another one.
let's go. Oh god, that's bad. I feel like I gotta just stay far from there. Do enough damage to where she charges that again. Get in and start beating the shit out of her. Also, whenever we go behind her, she'll do that. That was a lot of damage she just took. Yes. Oh, I'm stuck. I think if I just grab one of these, you know, there's no more bombs. Wait, can I just add fire to it then? Probably can. Okay. Punch you again. Get out of my face. Gonna charge me in on it, no, she's not. Hopping shit. Wondering also, do I need to hop if I'm that far away? Unless I'm just in the vicinity. Let's knock down again. Down again. Nice. <laughs> Jeez. Do it. Tear out her heart while she still lives. I want to hear her. 
the screen. I am one of the chosen. I can grant your every wish. Can you restore the balance? Well, we did it. Samuel requires his item of powerful arcane energy to unlock access to the Black Throne. And we got an arcane stone that increases our health. How the hell we get out of here? Oh. Without your feathered friend, how will you escape this prison of rock? I'll find a way. You have certainly proven yourself resourceful. Perhaps I can provide a quicker way. Speak plainly, demon. Serpent holes, ancient paths that worm their way beneath the husk of this dead world and beyond. I use them to get about, and for a price, so can you. What do you want, Baldrum? A trifle, really? The Chosen's heart. I felt its power the moment you stepped from that tower. You wound me, horseman. I would <laughs> never come between you and your friend Samayan. No, I only wish to look at the heart. One glance, and our bargain is sealed. <laughs> Samayan will be pleased. The Serpent Holes are yours, Horseman. Seek me out when you wish to use them. Okay. This ancient network of pathways flows throughout the world and beyond. Seek out the Fulgrim locations that gain access to these passageways. So. Teleport back there. This is cool. This obviously came out before God of War series on the PS3 and the PS4 or PS4 and PS5. But I remember they had their own versions of warp ways. So it's cool to see this again. I'm pretty maybe God of War got referenced this game for warp ways like that in between locations. Where is he at? Trust that she suffered? Not nearly enough. Beautiful. The second guardian, the griever, moves in tunnels beneath this place. But first there is sad obstacle that must be removed. All vain. One of the old ones. You didn't mention that before. Changing the deal already, Samael. Be silent, filth. <laughs> My business is with the horseman. Ulthane is no ally of the destroyer. But you won't find the griever without confronting the black hammer. And that will require strength you don't possess. Yet. What the hell do you think you're doing? Tell him, Watcher, how you stifle the horseman's true power in order to keep him on the council's leash. War. Destroy this parasite. 
you so much as blink at me, and the council will end you, both of you. I'm protected. Not in here. You are war, rider of the red horse. Not some puppet on this pathetic creature's streams. War? I will make you suffer. Focus your anger. A great rage stirs within you, clawing to get out. You must release it, or a puppet. Oh, I thought he killed him. I was like, I don't remember this. Alright, we're going to stop right here. We've done a lot, as is. Basically, I don't know if there's chapters in this game. Oh, we can now use chaos form? Okay, that's sick. Yeah, we're going to stop right here, and in the next video, we're going to continue forward from this point on, and deal with Uthane. So thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the content, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below. And until next time, everyone take care. Bye.